to 18 months in jail if he's convicted. Whoa, whoa, that is crazy. So NBA Timberwolves star swung a chair unintentionally, hit two people or whatever, and now they are getting to press charges. Usually this would happen, you would say sorry, probably pay a little fee, you know, a little lawsuit or whatever, and call it a day. They're trying to take this to court. So this is a whole nother ball game. So yes, Edwards must appear in court in Denver on June 9th. And if he's convicted, he can face up to 18 months with a thousand dollar fine as a third degree assault is considered a first class misdemeanor in Denver, Colorado. This is going to be crazy, okay? Because they said the security guard in the Denver Nuggets arena, two of them were not injured. Injuries weren't serious, but both of them still press charges. We had no injuries, but yet we're going to sue anyways. We know what you are. We are an NBA superstar. You got multi millions of dollars. We want to sue you. We want to press charges. This is crazy. But again, this all can be avoided if you swing the chair like a crazy person. Yes, the little type of tantrum he threw can really cost him a lot more. It could ruin his career as we know it if he is convicted. But I just think this whole thing is blown out of proportion over excessive. I know a lot of people have their thoughts and opinions on it, which is the reason why I want people to leave their thoughts and opinions in the comments. I want people to know, like, do you guys think this is worth 18 months in jail if he's convicted? Of course, you could hurt somebody. Now, I understand they were hurt. If they were hurt, then he should definitely get in trouble for that. But if nobody was hurt, there was no injuries, then it's kind of seemed like, you know, little cash grab shakedown kind of thing. I don't know. It seems kind of weird. But anyways, futuratively, please do not be swinging chairs around. I mean, just it doesn't make any sense. You want to let off your aggression, go in the locker room, do whatever. But do not be swinging chair in a crowd area. It's just not a smart idea. It's really stupid. So, um, yeah, hopefully he can get out of the situation, um, maybe pay a fee, a fine. And of course, the issue out apology. That's the main thing he should do is issue out apology, like a public state apology. I just don't think it's it's that serious enough to go that far. But hey, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. It's your boy Zane. Until next time, peace.